Alibaba Quen has released Quen 2.5 Omni. So Quen 2.5 Omni is an end-to-end -end multimodal model designed to perceive diverse modalities including text, images, audio and video while simultaneously generating text and natural speech responses in a streaming manner. Previously, they have released a 7 billion parameter model. Now they have released this 3 billion parameter model. If you look at the model parameter size, it is close to 5.4 5 billion parameters. But in the title, it is Quen 2.5 Omni 3B. Okay. Uh, so here is their architecture. So they have something called as a thinker and talker. So the thinker takes vision and audio inputs along with your prompt. And the talker produces text as well as audio output. So in my previous video, I have covered more about Quen Omni. 2.5 Omni. So in this video, let's just try it out and see how it performs on some use cases. So this notebook demonstrates how you can use Quen 2.5 Omni to obtain information from a video stream. I'm using an A100 instance. This is because when I went over here for GPU requirements, uh, they had mentioned that, you know, this particular model, if you're using 15 seconds of video, this particular model takes close to 18.38 GB of GPU VRAM. And depending upon the length of the video, you know, you require more GPU VRAM. So that is why I'm using an A100. Possibly this model could fit on a free T4 instance as well. So this is a paid instance. So the first thing you need to do is that you need to install this Quen Omni Utils Decode. So this library, right? Then you have to install Flash Attention with no build isolation for faster installation for the latest version of Flash Attention. Okay. Then what you have to do is that you have to install uninstall transformers and install this particular branch of transformers okay otherwise it's not going to work and you need to install accelerate omni utils quen omni utils and open ai so you can uncomment one by one and you can do this first you have to uninstall transformers existing transformers and then you need to install this uh, you know particular branch of transformers you need to install accelerate quen omni utils and open ai as well so once you have done all this installation it will ask for restarting the session so you have to restart the session then this is the inference function for video okay so here if you see I'm creating a conversation like this. This is the system role. This is a system prompt. You are Quen, a virtual human developed by Quen Team Alibaba group capable of uh, perceiving auditory and visual inputs as well as generating text and audio outputs. Okay. Uh, the user prompt is going to come over here. This is the path for the video. Okay. Um, so then you need to first uh, extract the text using processor.apply chat template by passing the conversation. Then you need to extract audios, images, videos. So you can use the audio in the video. So you have a flag for that. Uh, so this is the process MM info, which it does. Then you give this to the processor, text, audios, images, right? And you say this flag also use audio in video. And then you send this inputs to the model.device. So your GPU basically. And this is how you generate your audio output and text output from the model. You pass the inputs, you say use audio in video is equal to true. Basically the flag, it could be true or false. And you can decode the text and you can, you know, return the text. You can also write the audio output from the model. Okay, so then we load the model and processors. So from transformers, we need to import Quen2 underscore 50 Omni for conditional generation. Okay, uh, this is not 50, Quen2 underscore 5 Omni for conditional generation. Quen2 underscore 5 Omni processor. You specify the model path over here, Quen2.5 Omni 3B. You load the model over here, the flash attention implementation you specify like this. Okay, this is the processor for the particular model. Okay, so once you do this, it takes close to around uh, 10 GB or 11 GB of GPU RAM. Okay, for this model. Now this is for uh, IPython display for video. So here is a video path and this is the video which I have given as input. Okay, so I'm actually asking what can you see in this particular video and I am generating, you know, uh, the, uh, what do you call, the output from the model. So here it says, when I say, what can you see in the video? It says, well, in the video, I can see a bird standing on the grass near a body of water. It's got a mix of brown and orange colors in its body. There is also another bird that comes into view. It's a bit blurry, but you can tell it's also near water. The water itself is kind of brownish. There is some grass around. There is a bit of sound of wind in the background. Okay, so this is the output. When I asked this particular question. Okay, now let me just, you know, make this question as null and let me send this because I saw a good response just from the system prompt. Okay, so let me run this. It takes some time to generate this. In the meanwhile, we'll look at the other results. So this was another video which I had given as input. So you can see this particular video. So this is a market where, you know, there is this vegetable or fruits vendor having these fruits and vegetables. Okay, so it kind of detects this box as strawberries. 
it could be tomatoes also but mostly it's strawberries so it says that from what i can see in this video there are strawberries there are also some green beans this one and what looks like avocados probably this one green beans is over here sorry about that uh this looks like avocados even though it's out of focus okay uh but uh, i'm not sure about the exact type of fruits and uh in the containers you can probably check the video again or someone else might have seen it so this is what it gives us a response this is very good response for a small model of say 5 billion parameters right see now when i you know suppress the prompt over here in this in this particular video it says that oh that's a robin so this bird is a robin it's got this orange red belly black head robins are pretty common in north america they are often seen near water like in the picture you got there they are really good at finding food in water too so what else do you want to know about these little birds it's given a very good explanation of this particular video let's try one more video over here so this is one more video where there are wind chimes okay so here it says that it looks like that there are these wind chimes hanging on uh, hanging on a green wall there are different types some with beads others with shells there is also a drum hanging there it seems like a display of some sort it's going to again a very good explanation of this particular video as well now you can also do audio inference so let's look into that right so this is a audio inference function only difference is that here i am sending the audio in the user okay rest of the things are almost same over here okay you apply this process function where you extract audio images video and then you send to processor rest of the things are almost same over here in the inference function so this is an audio which i am sending over here okay transcribe the english audio into text without any punctuation marks that is my prompt uh mr quilter is the apostle of the middle classes and we are glad to welcome his gospel so mr, mr. quilter Quilt is the apostle so mr quilter is the apostle of the middle class and we are glad to welcome his gospel if you have any other audio transcribe please feel to know so it is done a very good audio transcription over here so this is an audio trans uh, this thing where we are going to you know listen to the provided english speech and produce a translation in chinese so i've already run it Mr Quilter is the apostle of Okay so let's take the chinese translation let's open google translate let's put chinese over here see it's done a very good translation but i don't know chinese so somebody can verify whether the translation whether the trans uh, relation is perfect okay so there is one more video which is about an audio uh, one more say audio uh, which is about you know uh, classifying an audio so let's see what it is uh, so here I have already run it, so there is a cough. So it says that classify the given human vocal sound in English, which is my prompt. It says that's a cough. If you have any other sounds you want to classify, please free to let me know. So I find the performance of this particular model in my limited test to be equivalent to the bigger model of Quen Omni, right? So previously I had done a video on Quen 2.5 Omni 7B. I am finding the performance to be quite close in my use cases and in my limited testing. So this is an excellent small model for an agent because this is end to end multi model it can perceive modalities diverse modalities like text images audio and video while some uh, simultaneously generating text and natural speech responses in a streaming manner so it had generated the audio for one of the this thing so let's try out this let's download the audio and try uh, let's listen to that oh that's a robin you're looking at it's got this orange red belly and a black head robins are pretty common in north america they're often seen near water like in the picture you So this is the audio output for you know this use case of where I had this video of the bird right for this particular bird. So it also had generated the audio output for this particular text. Okay, so the output of the model, this text is there right for which it can generate audio also, and that audio I've got there is this. They're really good at finding food in the water too. So you can create a agent with this particular model. where you can also have voice based interactions with the agent you can have voice based output also and you can change the speakers over here for the voice based output uh, so if you look at over here uh, they have specified it somewhere over here that you can ch uh, change the speaker for the output okay uh, so you can specify certain default speakers which they have and the audio will be generated in that particular speaker's voice okay so this could be a male voice this is a female voice things like that okay so these are the voice which is available on the output audio side okay so you have chelsea female a honeyed velvety voice that carries a gentle warmth and luminous clarity ethan is a male a bright upbeat voice with infectious energy and warm approachable vibe so you can do that as well so this is an excellent model in my opinion in in my limited testing you can also go and try it out okay uh so here are some benchmarks and other things of comparing this with other models i would not go into it but yeah so you can try out this model for say you know real time voice and video chat for natural and robust speech generation for strong modalities across various uh, strong performance across modalities 
So this was a video about Quen 2.5 Omni. You can go and test it out for your own purposes. I will share this collab notebook in the description of the video. Hope this video is useful. See you in another video.